Oh, power. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to part two of trying fruits for the first time. We've got a range of fruits. We went a bit more exotic this time. There's a bit more in the supermarkets. All these fruits are new to me. And looking at them, I don't know if they're off, if they're ripe, if they're not ripe or anything. So it's all hit and miss with this. So if you notice something, please comment below and let us know. So what we're gonna do this time is a bit of a roulette. So we're gonna go through what we've got first and then we'll take turns in picking what we wanna do, all right? So if you pick the fruit and we we'll both have that and see what it's like. Okay, so at the moment what we've got um, is passion fruit, watermelon, melon. This is another form of melon. It's a musk melon. Avocado, kiwi. And we've got just looks like a segment of a brain, which is pomegranate. I'll let you go first and pick which one we're gonna go for first. The one you hit, uh, avocado. Avocado first, wow. Right, okay, yeah. there you go. Avocado. Um, I've had it in a form of guac, so guacamole is made with the avocados. Oh, that's squishy. <laughs> Don't play with your food. <laughs> um, I've, so I've had it in the form of guacamole that's made with avocados and stuff like that, and I've had it in a smoothie and stuff, but I have no idea what the exact flavour is, and the texture feels disgusting, it feels slimy. Ready? Yeah. It tastes like nothing. So why'd you spit it out then? Because I don't like it. I don't like it either. I don't have to spit it out, I think I can. That's horrendous. Ugh. Oh, you probably picked the worst one first. <laughs> At least it's not the way. You're gonna have that flavour. Avocados are definitely a no and a no. Can you describe it? I just don't like the aftertaste. The aftertaste is worse. The aftertaste is worse, yeah, definitely. Next one. My choice is a melon. Mm. I don't like it, but I'm trying to keep it in my mouth to get rid of it as well. You don't like it? No. Alright, it's quite nice. I like that. No? No. No, it's two no's. It's you to choose. Watermelon. I just get a lot of melon that way. Have you had watermelon? Uh, I think so. think so. I think so. I think I've had frozen vodka water, watermelon, but that's different. What have I been doing for 36 years? Eating chocolate and chicken. Ready? Uh-huh. Ooh, that's really nice. It's not nice, but it's better than your other melon. My choice. Right, I'm gonna go for the one that looks like a gone off brain. That's two I'm looking at. Oh, then. Oh, yeah, then. that's... Passion fruit. And I mean, this is why I got to 36 without eating stuff like this. Because as a child, someone would have gone, oh, try this. And I looked at it and gone, I know. <laughs> because it looks like that. It does it smell does really smell nice. nice. If you look at it, it looks like fish eyeballs. Thanks. <laughs> Three, whole thing. Two, one, go. Mm. Oh, power. <laughs> oh, it's crunchy! <laughs> wow! That's worse than them brain liquor things you get! <laughs> wow! Either that's supposed to be really sour, or I've just fed you off fruit, I don't know. I mean, it doesn't taste horrible, but that was... It's just in a sudden impact, mm -hmm. isn't it? You don't realise. I'm gonna say yes for it, because the smell and the flavour are not bad, we just didn't expect how sour it was. Are you are you a yes for that? Yeah. Right, okay. There we go. Your choice? Kiwi. Kiwi? I've had it before. You've had it before? Mm -hmm. Alright, okay. Well I've never had it. First time, kiwi, 36 years. Three, two, one. It's a grape. Mm -hmm. Wow. It's a giant grape. I like it. I've still got a bit of... When you bite the seeds when I get a crunch, when I'm eating something so soft and I get the crunch, it just puts me off a bit, but again, I think that's from being a kid. So, but yeah, kiwi's a winner. I like that. Mm. Nice. 
It's because I bought a lot of pack of six of them. Okay, your choice. We are down to pomegranate. I mean, who discovered you could eat that? If I had cut that open as a cape man, I'd have gone, no. Let's stick with the wild boar. Um, and the musk melon. I guess I'll pick this just because you're going to go for melon. <laughs> <laughs> so, pomegranate. Ready? No. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Hmm. The third's nice, it's when you get to the seed. Do we eat the seed? Yeah, if you want. No. <laughs> I don't think I can eat one of them in public because I'd just be spitting the seeds out all the time. The flavour's nice though, right? Mm -hmm. I think we're ending on a pretty tame one, which is a form of melon, because usually the melon's been quite nice so far. I've noticed these. Slow. Yeah, they're a lot stickier. Ready? Big bite. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> I told you it's slippy. <laughs> Alright. Last one. Must melon. Bottoms <sighs> up. Three, two, one. Oh, it's tough. Oh wow. I got halfway through and I was like, gagged. Right, that's it. So we've gone through seven fruits there. Quite a lot of hits for me, to be fair. The most surprising, I think, being the passion fruit, because it looks the most horrendous. The, the kiwi I'm surprised at, because I'm not shocked at the flavor, like the passion fruit, where it's so sour, but it's just like a grape. So, you know, it'd be good to sit there with a spoon and eat a few of them, definitely. Glad I bought them. If you know any other fruits, you think of any fruits we should try, um, or anything else maybe, I hope that entertained you. Uh, broaden my horizons, certainly. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Stick the bell notifications on. Every time you do that, it supports us and helps us and inspires us to keep making content. Thanks for watching. See you all again soon. Bye. Au revoir. See you so smooth. <laughs>